Hello everybody, this is Alex the Titanosaur Emperor here with another uh, dinosaur review. And today, I'm going to be doing a review of my second of my 2018 collective figures. Now before we get started, uh, I do want to give you an update. I did get some new figures yesterday. And I'll just show them off here quickly. Here's one of them. I got them, this one at the uh, local Value Village. It's a thrift store in Canada and North America. Uh, it's the uh, second version of the iteration of the... Ba original Batat T-Rex. So, like, this one has the snowshoes. It's very accurate. The tail's not drooping down. I got this for about three bucks. Pretty neat. And then I just got this today. I was going to do an unboxing. I was in the middle of filming it. And then afterwards, I accidentally uh, turned it off. So, here it is. Uh, this is a figure I've been waiting for for a while. The uh, Schleich Shonisaurus. I probably will do a review of that soon. Because this is a figure I've been wanting wanting to get for a long time. So let's get on to the review itself. Now today I'm going to be viewing the review of the uh, uh, Collecta 2018 Deluxe Iguanodon. Now Iguanodon, which name means Iguana Tooth, was a genus of ornithopod, Iguanodon ornithopod, that lived in the early Cretaceous period of Europe, but also lived most, most other around the world. So like North America, South America, I think. Like those are the places I know they lived. Uh, and... Again, it lived alongside many different dinosaurs. Now let's get to the figures. Actually, I'm actually quite surprised they did an Iguanodon this year. And I should have seen this coming. Like, well, I should have seen this coming, but I was a bit surprised still to see an Iguanodon this year, even though we got the Ceraxosaurus last year. And I kind of been picky about my Iguanodons. I prefer them on all fours, which, again, like, I'm just picky like that. And I gotta say, they did an excellent job on this figure. I heard a lot of good things about the Iguanodon, and I'm just going to say right here, it is probably one of the best Iguanodon figures out there. <clears throat> yes, even, yes, even better than the Safari, 20, the Safari 26 uh, Iguanodon from 2016. It's that good. And, it, like, first of all, I gotta say the paint style, it slightly reminds me of the Walking with Dinosaurs Iguanodon. Sorry if I'm stuttering a bit, I'm just a bit tired today. Um, I gotta say, it does remind me of it. It doesn't look exactly like it, but it, if you want something like that's close to the Walking with Dinosaurs Iguanodon, this is probably the closest you'll get, besides getting the actual figure, which costs an arm and a leg. Um, now it's, um, it's got the head sculpt. This is really well done. The mouth is open, but it's not articulated, as uh, usual. But, uh, it has the tongue, which is painted. The interior of the mouth... It does seem like it's painted, as you can barely see on my terrible Android camera. <laughs> uh, the eyes, well done. And also the scales are individually sculpted, which I do appreciate. And also it's kind of really easy to tell if they're individually sculpted since, yeah, again, you can just tell on them because the painting might not have been thorough enough, but I don't know if that is the... Uh, the tail figure is about the it's about twenty nine centimeters, so it's about average size for one of the one forty scale iguanodon uh, one scale forty scale dinosaurs. Sorry if I'm stuttering. Um, got the underneath here. We got the uh, cloaca, three toed feet. Then you have the famous spike thumb. Now we'll compare it with the other figure I reviewed in my last review, the Mantellisaurus. And I gotta say, like, Collect is improving this year. Like, last year and 2016, they weren't the best years for them. Like, again, you don't really have anything that actually, any variety. did either did all theropods or all ceratopsians, or most ceratopsians. And this year, they actually went with, actually, a good variety of figures. Like, they did two ornithopods, and also, I should be receiving the other two uh, Collecta figures for 2018 next week as well, so I shall be seeing reviews of the Mapusaurus and the uh, Scurry Minus soon. Okay, so this has been my review of the 2018. I would definitely recommend this figure of Isle of Mains. Uh, 2018 Iguanodon. My next review will be of the uh, awesome 2018 Collecta Dunkleosteus. And I will see you guys in the next video. Okay, bye.